and low tera extension they are wallet extension on your chrome you can use your chrome to do this thing you need to do this thing with your pc now the next thing to do is to go to google and search go to google and type terra terra station extension you can see it terra station extension now this is it to here you can click on the link all right so i have it already installed I have it already installed on my PC. You can see. So if I don't have it already to install it, it's all it, it's all you can see there is for me to add it. So because I have it already installed, that is why it's showing me to remove. But if you are doing it, you will just click on add on uh, your Google extension or add to your Chrome. Automatically, you wait for some minutes and you add it. Now, once you do that, the next thing you need to do is to create your wallet. So once you do that, you see that here. You can see it here on top here. So click on it. It's an extension. It looks like Metamax. All right. So once you are done with that, this is where it will bring you. You have an option to create a new wallet or to recover a wallet or to import a wallet or to you have a multi new multi wallet or to use a, a ledger if you have a ledger. So if you already have a wallet, all you need to do is to recover your wallet. But if you don't have a wallet or on the Terra station, all you need to do is to click on new wallet. If you click on new wallet. It will take you to another place. So this is where you give your wallet a name. Give your wallet a name. You can just name your, your wallet anything. You can just type in Deep Tutors for the purpose of this video. All right. Uh, you just put your password. Then this is your, your phrase, your key. This is your 12 phrase key. All you need to do is to copy it and keep it safe. Guys, if you lose this thing, you might not have access to your account. Now, I believe you must have already heard about this thing in crypto before. You need to pay attention to such kind of information and make sure you keep it safe. Now, the next thing is to do is to click I have written it down. You can see they ask you to write it down. If you just click I have written it down, the next thing is for you to submit. The reason why it's not showing me to submit is because I didn't fill out this information up here rightly. So because this is just a, a tutorial video. So just follow this process. You you will just create an account on the Teller Station wallet. All right. So but next, what I want to do is for me to recover wallets because why? I already have a wallet I will want to use to do. I, I want to use in this video. So let me go ahead to recover the wallet. I click on recover wallet. Now if I want to recover wallet, so all I need to put is I will put my wallet name, my password, and my 12 phrase key, and this index I will leave it at zero like it is here. I will leave it at zero so that is how to recover wallet so i'm going to be pausing this video i'm going to put i want to put my 12 phrase code i'm going to come back and show you what we are going to do next so let me go ahead and pause this video i'm coming back welcome back i have successfully recovered my account all I, after doing this the next thing for me to do is to connect i will have to connect it so this is my account now i already have for 494 USD. Now let me explain what USD is. USD is like the way we have USDT. Now USD is the stable coin of the Teller blockchain. So that is what USD is all about. So I have 494 USD. So let's go back to our Terra. Let's go back here. All right. So this is it. So once you come here, the first thing you need to do is for you to connect your wallet. So just connect it. You can see connect. You can see it will ask you Terra Station. Just click on Terra Station. This is how to connect your wallet after you must have already created a new wallet or you already imported one. So just click on Connect. All right. So we have automatically connected our wallet. Now, the next thing is for us to do is to click on Swap. I believe you can see Swap below Dashboard. Just click on Swap. Now, once you come here, this is when you can do transaction. Now, let me show you how you can be able to do this transaction. You need money to do this transa transaction. All you need to do is just to maybe $100 for you to be able to swap. You are not buying any coin. You are still going to withdraw it back to wherever you send it from. I'm going to be showing you how you can deposit on this, your wallet, on the, on the Terra Station wallet, and use it to do this transaction. All right, let's go back to our Terra Station. Remember, all the link you need will be on the description below. So this is our Terra Station. Now, when you come here, let, let me refresh it. All right, you can see I have 494 UST in this my Terra Station account, and I have zero Luna in this account. So this is what I have. 
now how do you get this money here now the first thing you need to do is to go to your binance and use your usdt to buy ust remember go to your binance use your usdt to buy ust i don't know if there is a there is any other exchange that is accepting terra withdrawal but right now all i know is binance all you need to do is to make your withdrawal using the binance network binance network has terra network on it binance exchange has terra network on, on it so let me explain to you how you can do it now when you come when you come to your binance all you need to do is to use your usdt to buy ust remember you can't use usdt to do this you need ust which is the stable coin of the terra blockchain just come on the search button type ust yeah you can see ust here just click on ust then you go to advanced trade this is like sports trade or you go to a classic trade anyone the way you do normal sport trading on your phone just but this is just a laptop view showing you how to do this but it's very simple if you can use your phone to do this by just going to your sports account and be able to do perform this transaction now all you need to do is to buy ust using your ust using your usdt now all you need to do is to put the amount that you want to buy with and click on the buy button so just go ahead and buy ust i already have ust you can see here i have about 300 ust so because i wanted to send it for me to perform more transaction so i can earn more when the airdrop finally drops now once you do that come here go back to your terminal wallet and copy your wallet address if you copy your wallet address the next thing for you to do is for you to send the ust you have purchased so let's go to our terminal address sorry okay yeah this is it so this is the uh, this is the wallet address here just click on it if you click on it it will show you copy automatically we have copied it now what's next the next thing is for you to go to your binance if you go to your binance then you go ahead to withdraw it now once we come here we'll go to we'll go to funding go to funding wallet now once we come to funding wallet the next thing we can do is just to withdraw our money withdraw it to our terra blockchain so click on ok the next thing is to click on withdraw the way you do your normal withdrawal on binance just click on withdraw so once you click on withdraw this is where you choose your currency that you want to withdraw click on it you will choose us ust just click on ust you can see it there then you put your wallet address you paste it here paste your wallet address sorry so it will ask you the network you choose support memo now you don't need memo right now we are not using memo for this just click on confirm just click on confirm but you don't need the memo yeah you don't need the memo then the next thing is for you to scroll down now you can see it has automatically verified that this is a terra blockchain but if you click on it you have other blockchain we have a uh, bsc we have ethereum and we also have polygon please use terra terra is the network we are sending it to which is ust so you can see it there then the memo leave it optional then this is where you put the amount you want to send but the minimum you can send out is ten dollar you can send hundred dollar you can send five hundred dollar you can send one thousand so any amount of your choice you can actually send so once you put the amount the next thing for you to do is to click on the withdraw button you can see the withdraw button here so i don't need to okay let me just put hundred okay so now you just click on withdraw button they will charge you one dollar network fee for this transaction but i don't need to make any withdrawal because why i already have ust on my terra blockchain